Hi, I'm Colm Gorey with Silicon Republic, and with St. Patrick's Day upon us, we look at four apps that might make you want to change your nationality. Given the lack of variety in St. Patrick's Day apps, Flapping Pat is as innovative as it gets with this Flappy Bird ripoff. Watch as the little leprechaun navigates his way through pipes collecting his shamrocks. It's clumsy, it's repetitive, and has more pop-up ads than an early 2000s malware, yet has all the hallmarks of an addictive game. While not a specific St. Patrick's Day app, iBeer is certainly made out to be one. Using the awesome power of your phone's gyroscope, you can now pretend to drink beer and gain patronizing sympathy from all your friends. To give you an idea of who this is targeted at, its promotional message says, Not old enough to legally drink or just don't feel like it? Have an eye beer. I'd rather not, thanks. Everyone loves quizzes, so why not find out about Ireland's patron saint through a poorly designed but relatively interesting app, Quizzle. I think I'll stick to Quizzle, which can at least create a St. Patrick's Day quiz that isn't offensive to my eyes. We have to try at least one photo editing app, so step forward the unimaginably named St. Patrick's Day photo. Put ginger beards, pipes and rainbows all over your photos for no other reason than, sure why not? The definition of cheese, it's pretty terrible but it definitely has a market out there for some who just want some cheap laughs.